all on. If y'all don't start commenting and sharing and subscribing, it's going to be me and y'all. Yeah. Stop playing with me. Comment. Hello, my fault. Go to the video. Hello. Bring some of that royalty. What's up, y'all? It's your girl, Neek G, the host, and today I'm back with another reaction video. Before we go any further, make sure y'all like, comment, subscribe, and share this video. You dig what I'm saying and what the goddamn hell you leak. So, Ray So Wavy comments under Lindasia's video and spills tea. She also went live and defends Neek. Who went live to defend Neek? We gotta watch this. So, y'all, this just piggybacking off of the video I posted the other day uh, reacting to Lindasia. Basically saying Ray allegedly cheated on her or not cheated, but... Her and Neek was flirting, so that's why she cut off. But anyway, let's get it. Tuned into Lindeja's assumptions and answers. You guys know some of the things that she was saying. Now, she did get Ray angry that Ray commented underneath that video. Ray said... So, I like reading my own shit, but... um, <laughs> Ray said, you're not being 100% truthful, and I don't like that. I had love for you, so I'm not even going... Bring this shit to social media, but Deja, stop speaking on me. Let it go. Go be happy for real, for real. <laughs> Fear, as you should. Not to mention when you took my was the okay, right. So this is the response that Lindasia gave, um, Ray. She said, "Where's the where's the lie? Where was the lie at? I did not once lie in this video. Not to mention when you took my phone and we got into that altercation." You reset my entire phone, so I won't have no proof of anything. Y'all, that's crazy as hell. <laughs> if she did that, that's crazy as hell. Uh, stop acting so damn innocent and act like I'm lying about anything, Raynesha. It's really sad now. You do this with every chick you fall out with. I spoke my truth, and now people seeing it differently. You hate it because you were getting, getting a thrive out them bashing me without knowing the truth for real. I cleared it and that was my last time speaking on shit. I'm happy in real life and I hope you are too. Stay blessed. Find That's crazy me. as hell. Stop acting. I mean it. I've been. So after that, Ray responded and said, are you dumb? That's what it sounded like. That's what it looked like. Are you dumb? <clears throat> Do this with every girl. Now Ray in her defense. This is true. Uh, nah, cause I could have been took it there with you. This ain't speaking no truth. Tell them how I even found out about you and dude. That, that'll kill all this shit right now. Straight up. You be smooth. You got it. Now, here's my thing. First of all, she didn't deny the fact that she took her phone and reset it. I ain't gonna lie. That's some crazy shit. <laughs> to take somebody whole phone and reset it is some wild shit. But, um, anyway, listen, y'all. I feel as though... Lindasia was definitely not over men. Now, she's saying, Lindasia is claiming that she was being disrespected the entire relationship and shit. Because apparently she feels as though Neek and Ray got something more going on than they saying they do. So she wasn't feeling that shit. So I think she decided to start talking to a dude. However, I don't feel like she was ever over men. Hence is why I feel like she instantly went straight to cuz. Now, for them to be so close, her and old dude, like, they close. You know what I'm saying? And it's so fast, I feel like she been talking to the nigga. You know what I'm saying? She been talking to the nigga to make sure she can line everything up when in the event she was going to leave Ray because, you know, she didn't have a place to stay, like shit like that. Respectfully, you know, she had to make sure she had du her ducks in a row. No cap. So this is alleged. I don't know what's going on with them. I don't know what's going on in their household, but I'm just telling y'all what I got and what I get from it. You know what I'm saying? Took it there with you. Okay. Gonna, Evelyn Deja was talking to this dude while she was in a relationship with Ray. I wouldn't be surprised if she he was, was talking to really him. genuine friend. Now, also, we've all looked at Ray and Neek's videos, even when she was with Lindasia. And I definitely, I, I'm gonna give y'all an example the TikTok video. The TikTok video where you had to grab the girl hand and the girl, um, you turn the girl around and she, you know, shake that ass in front of the camera and you looking at her. You know what I'm saying? That's like some couple shit. And maybe Lindasia just didn't, you know, she didn't want to do that TikTok. Um, but when she did that shit with Neek, I was like, what the fuck? <laughs> Let me do some shit like that. I'm about to die tonight, nigga. So um, I just, I thought that was a little too much. You know what I'm saying? But not only that, it was just, they was just around each other so much. And like, it's okay for people to be friends, y'all. Like two attractive people can be friends and not, 
you don't want to have any involvement with one another, but I just don't feel as if they didn't have any involvement with one another. So for Lindasia to pick up a second person, I feel like, I feel like Ray and Neek gave her that ammo. Now, was she right? No. Was Ray right? No. But I always tell y'all, these people, they in their 20s. They in their 20s. They got a lot of money. I don't even know why they expect certain things. Now, granted, you got certain couples that's 20, between 20 and 25, and they very much responsible. They should have just all the way together. <laughs> you know, they got a lot of money, They but they got kids. They just, they different. But then you got the ones that's like them, and they just not different. You know what I'm saying? What much, what? How much can you expect from a 23 year old? You know what I'm saying? Like, I just, I just, feel, I just wish they all wouldn't take things so, so damn serious. But, um, <clears throat> everybody wants love. I just feel like Lindasia kind of lined herself up for when she left Ray. That's what she I feel She like. did state and say that is just Neek's personality. <clears throat> she do believe a lot of people are jealous of Neek. Guys, please don't kill me. I cannot find that clip, but I do have everything else. My favorite zodiac sign is between a mm, it's a Capricorn. I love caps. Like they just dope as fuck. I love caps. I Neek is a Capricorn. I would have said a Virgo, but like realizing like from me Ray falls all on everybody in this touchy with everyone. Everybody she do a video with, she do that. <clears throat> just in her defense. She she does that. Dating Virgo. She one of them, <laughs> Ray one of them, when she laugh, like, you know those, uh, like, skits where a person laugh and then they push you and shit, <laughs> and then you laugh back and they push you and then to the point where y'all push each other real hard and shit? That's what Ray do. She laughs, she fall all over you. That's her, just her way of, I guess, laughing. But I feel like she be doing that with everybody. Virgos, because I've dated two Virgos, and they actually been my longest relationships, like, they cool, but I feel like I vibe with Capricorns. Like, appreciate the resale, bro. Like, I don't know. Like, the dynamic between me and a Virgo and me and a Capricorn is both dope as fuck. But it's like I'm more comfortable. I hate when with people do cap. that, kid. I don't know. And you know what else I hate? Just, when somebody put their damn arm on my shoulder. Like, if we out in public, and a nigga just put their arm on my shoulder, maybe you don't get the fuck off me. <laughs> like. First of all, I came out here fresh. Not for you to cover up my outfit, number one. Number two, go lean on something else. <laughs> go lean on something else, not on me. I hate that shit. I ain't gonna like lie. I said before, <laughs> Ray has been posting a lot about a Capricorn, and that is her ex. Lenazia so apparently her ex was the one who was in the video. Wrong, but they have been posting a lot more of each other after this Valentine's Day celebration. This is a photo that she posted on her Instagram of her and Ray. Ray was on her live. Ray will fly as hell right here, boy. I'm telling you, fly as hell. Doing Q&As. <laughs> now, one of the questions that her supporters asked, what was her least favorite thing about being an influencer? Now, she did state that she just misses her privacy and she is getting back into being more private and understanding that she doesn't have to share everything with okay, the, her to raise live. She did end up coming on. Oh, you look so damn good. Then went back to her ex. Okay. Live and Ray just cut Instagram stories. I ain't even give it yet. Running up a silly check. Yum, not a fucking. squad is, you ask her questions to put me on a T-page. You're just going to see when you see. No, I'm joking, y'all. That's, that's, I don't know if she what? on the live. Is she on the live? Let me, let me not say too much because I ain't trying to get smacked upside my head. I let her fuck. I don't know why people think they be sneaking around doing shit like we don't know. Me as a bitch. <laughs> ain't nobody acting nervous, bro. Y'all are annoying as fuck. Like, be fucking for real. Nervous. Never. Not Ray. Okay. Did get on Ray's live and you know Ray, like I said, could not stop blushing. Her boo did comment a smiley face and Ray did ping it on her live. She just letting it be known. Let me all right, so Ray went back to the ex. Um, allegedly. I don't want to get all into this video because I ain't even come here for all that. I just really wanted to talk about um, Lindasia and Ray basically exposing the fact that they both was talking to somebody else is what is given. Um, Ray resetting her phone, if that's true, is crazy as hell. Uh, but other than that, 
you know, I'm glad Lindasia has moved on. Apparently, Lindasia, uh, LaBoo thing snapped on her again last night. I would like to see that. Um, but other than that, I wish both of them well, bro. Lindasia looked like she, she's living a, a great life. She got her own crib now, you know what I'm saying? And I feel like if she didn't re leave Ray, she wouldn't have her own spot. She would not have had her own spot. So, uh, it was time for her to stop getting, um, what do you call, like, she was spoiled. It was time for her to kind of work for her own shit. You know what I'm saying? And she she gets real offended or defensive when you say she didn't have no money or she didn't, you know, have her own things. But you she, you, you didn't have your own things, friend. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? At least you didn't have your own place. So it was absolutely, thank you, friend. It was absolutely time for her to be independent and, um, you know, have her own man just have on so uh i'm done with this video y'all let me know what you think down in the comment section below love y'all appreciate y'all hell yeah